Hey guys, welcome back to King Owls, and yes, uh, this is now your Manchester United news now for you guys. Aaron Wan-Bissaka is injured and should now apparently be out for two months. Uh, it, it's a joke, to be fair, what's going on at this club at this moment in time. It honestly is. Everything with the it, with our injury list, it's a joke. I'm going to go through that in a minute. Um, and also with the takeover and the results on the pitch, especially as well. Joke. All round, to be fair. It's it's an embarrassment to be a Manchester United fan right now. Let's be real. It is. Uh, and it's an absolute... Dis like We're an absolute disgrace of a club at the moment. Let's be real. Just all round. Things need to change on the pitch with the results. We need new owners. And Jesus Christ, these injuries are getting ridiculous now. Bloody hell. Well, we can't have a normal day at this club. We cannot have a normal day at this club. Aaron Wan-Bissaka is injured. I mean, clearly, like, you know, obviously he didn't start in that game against Brighton. Clearly, clearly he did have a few issues before that anyway. But, ah, oh, oh, my God, it's so... Oh. Anyway, look, uh, th this is our this is our injury list. So we got Tom Heaton who is injured. We've got Aaron Wan-Bissaka who is now injured. Luke Shaw is injured. Mason Mount, Kobe Mainu, Tyran Malassia, Rafael Varane, Sofian Amrabat, and Ahmad Diallo, plus Anthony and Jaden Sancho are unavailable due to their reasons. Obviously, with Anthony, like we all know everything that's going on with him, uh, and Jaden Sancho and his arguments with Ten Hag. Oh, it's a joke, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, I mean, just uh, who's going to be next is the question. Honestly, there's going to be someone next, but because this club's cl cursed at the minute, there's something bloody going on, and it's a joke. Let's be real. Um, yeah, uh, we're screwed when we play Bayern on Wednesday, that's all I know, and there's a chance we lose to Burnley as well, let's be real, there is, you never know with this team at the moment, especially when we play away, Bayern away, I am dreading, Burnley away, uh, it's gonna be a tough one, I know it is, um, but yeah, like, we, we can't get any luck at, the, at Manchester United right now, we cannot, we do not have any luck at all, Everything is against us right now. It's such a pain in the bloody backside. It really is. And, you know, um, just uh, if, if someone like Bruno or Casemiro or Martinez, some, like someone like that, Bruno, Casemiro, Martinez, one of them get injured, we are completely screwed. If Hoyland gets injured, we are screwed. If Rashford gets injured, we are screwed. If two out of those, like, five names I just said get injured, we are, we, it's, we are completely fucked. Let's be real. Uh, we can't afford 20 more injuries, but that's what you get when we don't have enough squad debt. That's it. And that's why these fucking owners, the Glazers, must get out. If you look at all these big six sides right now, they have squad debt. They, they, that's what they have. You look at Arsenal, they have, like, they, they've got squad debt now. City, the reason why they're doing so well is because of their Royal and they're able to get so much squad debt. That's why they're doing so well. Liverpool, they've got squad debt. Like, it's a joke. Manchester United, we don't have nowhere near as much as them. It can, it, it, it's a joke, let's be real. I mean, Chelsea are in a similar situation to us, but Chelsea have been irrelevant now for the past couple of years. This is Manchester United. We should be the best club in England. It, it, it's a joke right now. It honestly is. Oh, Jesus Christ. I honestly call the season off already. Anyway, look, thanks for watching the video, King. I'll speak to you on a bit. Thanks for watching. Peace out.